Hi Falcons, today we're going to talk a little bit about density. Um, what we're going to do for this demonstration is we're going to compare two cans of soda, two cans of Coke, to see if they are more or less dense than water. Um, density, as you recall, is a measurement of mass per unit of volume, uh, D equals M over V. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to take this can of Coke and see if it's more or less dense than water. So I'm going to place it in and see what happens. You can see that it goes to the bottom, meaning that it has a greater density than water, uh, more mass per unit of volume than water does. Recall water has a mass per unit of volume of roughly 1.0. Now I'm going to try the same with this Coke Zero. And you can see, interestingly, that the Coke Zero floats while the Coca-Cola sinks. So the question is, why? Why does this happen? The first thing you might want to say is, well, maybe they're different sizes, okay? And as I look at the label, both of them are 12 fluid ounces or 355 milliliters. So they occupy the exact same volume. The next thing I would want to do is to take a minute and get their mass. So I have a balance over here, and I could take the mass of both of them, but I've already done that prior to the video. And what I show you here is that the Coke, the Coca-Cola, has a larger mass than the Coke Zero. Now, why is that? The reason for that is how they're designed or how they're made. Both Coke and Coke Zero have water and flavoring, but Coke Zero, the zero stands for zero sugar. It's missing a bunch of particles. It's missing those sugar particles. It's re replaced with aspartame um, uh, flavoring that's, you know, a little tiny packet is the same as all of the grams and grams and grams of sugar that are present in a Coke. And that difference in mass, 383 grams, versus 371 grams is the difference in density in the two things. Um, this mass is the mass inside the can, so the mass of the can itself will be slightly larger than that, it's large enough that this one has a mass slightly greater than 1.0, the density of water, 1.0 grams per milliliter, while this one has a mass slightly less than 1.0 grams per milliliter. And that explains the difference in density between Coke and Coke Zero. It's that difference in the number of or amount of mass or matter inside the can. The Coke has the sugar element where, or compound, sugar compound, while the Coke Zero does not. Um, and that explains this video.